much at this point. <laughs> <laughs> so spring show is basically like a big show with one theme and we have MCs that kind of carry that storyline. And then we do dances according to the overall theme throughout the show. We start by having just a meeting and organizing everything and picking the theme, picking who's gonna choreograph what dances, what music we're gonna do, stuff like that. And then we announce it to the rest of the team. And then as soon as we announce it, we start choreographing and teaching dances. That process typically takes like from February to April. So it takes a while for everyone to learn the dances. I think there's like 14 new dances usually. Yeah. So there's a lot. Spring shows normally our primary um, like fundraising event, but then also it's kind of our main spring event because in the fall we have football season and everything like that and sidelines and even competitions in the fall. And in the spring, we don't have any competitions. We have a few basketball games, but our main event is spring show. It's the only thing that's like completely focused around us. It's not like, us filling in a time, like a halftime or like a timeout during a football game. It's like, it is completely about dance and like the show that goes around it. Yeah. And I think Blue Valley North Spring Show especially is like really unique because a lot of the other Blue Valley schools have a show, but it's more like, a, it's more like a recital instead of an actual like Showcase. event. It's not really a show. Whereas we have the MCs and there's sometimes even a plot line and stuff like that. It's really entertaining to come watch. We also get to feature the junior and senior boys. So <laughs> check that out. <laughs> right now it's April 27th and 28th, those evenings. As of right now, each dancer will be able to give out at least six tickets. And then that still leaves some space for walk-ins, 